So this video is going to be a um, quick summary of how to replace the battery on a Hayward Aquapod 2 remote control for the ProLogic filter control. First thing you have to do is remove the six screws, Phillips head, tiny little screwdriver will do it. This is the factory issued battery once you remove the cover. And you can see I'll put the other one on top of it or next to it. You can see it's pretty close. So this ba this battery has um, was attached with the adhesive backing tape. So I had to really kind of pull it off and kind of help it along with my screwdriver. But it was you can see there's a lot of adhesive there. So that's the old battery. This um, came right out of the, um, you know, the female connector there. So um, not much trouble at all. So I put a little um, strip of um, double back tape to put it on the spot where the old uh, adhesive was. Um, the cable inserted with no issue at all into the um, female um, receptacle. So the battery's connected now and I'm gonna screw it back together. I'll put the cover on before I screw it on to see if it works. Put it on the charger. It's actually taking the charge. You can see it's blinking on the top right. So, so far so good. We take it out of the charger and it does, my old one discharged immediately. When I took it off out of the cradle, it would sit, it would literally um, shut off within like 10 seconds. So already, um, I only had it on there for like three minutes. And you can see the battery, it looks like it's almost at 80 percent it did not come on um the unit did not come on until i put it in the cradle so it almost like it had to have some kind of initiation um because there's no way the battery charged that much in three minutes so you can see it's discharging pretty quickly it lost already one of those bars since i've been talking but um now you see the screen shut down in 10 seconds. Touch the key point. That's just an automatic shut off. So I'm going to keep it going. But I can tell you, my old battery by now would have been, the screen would have been off, display uh, blank, and I'd have to put it back in the cradle and wait a few minutes for it to come on. So you can see that um, this battery is working. I'm really happy with it. Um, way better than $250 or whatever they charge for more for a new one of these and to have somebody else do the service for 125 dollars trust me you can do it yourself order the part from alibaba um the link will be on the uh, youtube 